Destiny is in your hands. Only you can become the Shaman King. And that's what we're talking about today, ladies and gentlemen. Hold up, you don't think I got what it takes Better back it up, step in the deck, oh that's a mistake You get no love, all of you snakes, phonies and fakes You get voted up, Detroit smash all in your face Better listen, back in the punch and it's not a joke Man, I'm ripping them, fist is clenched, crack in your throat, yeah If I see a villain, then it's not a debate I'll keep punching till I run out of places in the United States I gotta go beyond, plus some trust Plus some trust, plus some trust I gotta go beyond, plus some trust Yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy, you gave Trudy Shield. Welcome to another episode of Anime Month! This is actually the very first ever episode of a full Anime Month video, so I hope you guys enjoy it. I feel like I have two of these out a week. I don't know how well it's going to work out, so please bear with me with upload schedules when it comes to these types of videos. But I'm just about time we talk about this gem. Shaman King. Shaman King is an anime that aired from like 2000 to 2002. Just a year before my personal favorite anime, Sonic X. But, but um, like Sonic X, this actually ended up getting the 4 kids slap on it. And was aired on Jet X alongside Sonic X, Yu-Gi-Oh! and a bunch of other shows along the same time. And uh, yeah, unfortunately the dub is the same way with this game. What's with... What's, look at this, this is T for teen. No teenager is going to be wanting to play the One Piece Grand Battle and Shaman King Power of Spirit with the T waiting on it. And heck, why is Yu-Gi-Oh weighted E, but some of the Yu-Gi-Oh games I picked up is weighted T. This makes no sense to me at all. The weightings for these games are just ridiculous, but I digress. Go, so what is Shaman King? Because to my knowledge, I never heard of it until I picked up this game and played it. Well, bear with me here, considering that I just started to try to get into the anime, and this is my gateway to it. So a lot of the info from this game, as well as info online, is how I figured out about this. So from what I can tell, Shaman King was an underrated anime. And um, uh, from what I can tell, also, not a lot of people enjoyed it back in the day. But now a lot of people are starting to get to it, and it's ha now having the Full Metal Alchemist Syndrome. Well, they're remaking the anime, but it's more aligned with the manga instead of with um, whatever we got here. So, uh, okay then. My journey follows Yo Hakama. I probably just butchered his name. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm the worst weeb when it comes to this type of stuff. So please bear with me. So Yo Hakama is a boy that um, is wanting to become the Shaman King. Shaman Kings basically are the savior of the world, basically. And they ha do this tournament to see who can become the Shaman King by, of course, bowing it out. And shamans are these type of spirits that can, um, basically aid you in battle. I would like to think of them more like Personas, or at the very least, Stance from JoJo. Because they're both kind of, all three of them have the similar premise. Basically help the main character out and make him look awesome while doing it. But you know something? Unlike, uh, Naruto and Dragon Ball, Yo doesn't want to fight, like, at all. Like, he's not really the one to fight. He kind of reminds me of Aang from At Last Elbendor. But, I digress. So, going on with the main story of this game, you keep on, like, becoming new friends, you have a wife at 16? Yeah, yeah, and four kids. Let's get that anime. Let's get the anime where the kid has a wife at 14. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, four kids. I don't understand you at times. But anyway, keep on going on with the story, and you realize that you find this evil group, and then you start beating them up. It's all this else type of stuff that you'll see in a Shonen Jump anime. But how does the gameplay? That's the real me of this video. How does Power of Spirit play on the PlayStation 2? Well, it's actually kind of uh, kind of cool, actually. Um, you see, it plays like a um, strategy games in terms of something like Fire Emblem, but as soon as you initiate combat, it's a fighting game. You go out, you go and bite all baddies. It's a full-on fighting game. I mean, the controls are a bit, uh, I guess, dated by today's standards. But just like Ultimate Ninja and just like Grand Battle, it's still pretty fun to play to this day. Now, unfortunately, there's only a one-player mode throughout this, so I can't get into like a multiplayer fighting game. But, uh, I mean, I can't recommend it as a multiplayer fighting game. 
But as a single player adventure? I recommend this game! It's so dang cool! The combat is so good to use once you finally figure out how to use it. But the only thing that I don't like about it is that Yo is the main character, so unfortunately you're going to be controlling him throughout the main game, which I personally don't mind. But as soon as you get some of the other party members that you can control, you can't really initiate a full combat, let alone see what they're doing. It's like when you're waiting for to play Smash Online and you have the option to spectate. That's basically what we did. That's that's basically what you do when you control the other people. Because you control where you want to go, and I guess they can be your healing partners to help heal your character when they're hurt. But that's the best way I can describe it. And that's my only way of life with the game. But the music, the presentation, uh, well I guess I should really talk about one other issue I do have. You see that some cutscenes, they will allow you to ha listen to the voice actors from the dubbed anime. But unfortunately, it's just only bits and pieces of it. Like, if you're going to voice the game, I would say go the extra mile and voice all the cutscenes. But they tend to, like, come, like, few and far between. So it's a little bit jarring to, like, be listening to a cutscene and then all of a sudden not really start listening to the cutscene. But other than that, I like the group of characters in this show. I want to actually sit down and try to track down the manga or the original for a kid's version if all possible. I don't even know. I would rather get as much Shaman King as I can possible so I can go and sit down and enjoy it. Because that's what I do this anime month is to try to find anime or anime inspired stuff that I want to share with you guys. So if you guys haven't already, check out um, Shaman King um, Power of Spirit. I only spent like 9 bucks on this game. You, you're you not going to break the bank, at least to my knowledge. I don't have to check eBay or whatever. But, uh, yeah, that's the first game on the, uh, anime month list. Uh, okay, what's next? Uh, what's next? Uh, no, not this one. I know what it is. Help me! 